Say you want to bring your images to life in VideoScribe. This lecture shows you how to bring movement to your images with simple morphing effects. Whether you want to make an image to move around, expand outward, disappear, rotate, or transform to another. Let's see how we can do each. Starting with the moving around image, I have added the first element. Set the camera position. And then I will make a copy of this element and set it to the next side of the canvas. If I click preview, it will play like this. To make this element go to the second one or move to the second one as if it is one element, we will open the properties of the second element and click on the Morph tab and click Morph from the previous element. Make sure to check the clear item to clear the previous one so it can appear as it is one element. Now let's see how it will play. If you want to make it move more faster, adjust the settings of the animation time, pose, and transition. This is up to you. Last thing in this part is to show you how to take the element off the camera scene. I made another copy of this element. With the same camera position, I won't change the camera position. And I will do the morph to morph the third element from the second one and adjust the drawing times. So here we have the element moving off the camera scene. Second thing is to make the Superman move outward. I will do a copy of this element and resize it and make the big Superman morph from the smaller one.
Now I will show you how to make this Superman disappear. I will make a copy from the smaller one and make it morph from the big one. Next one is the rotation. Make a copy from this element, then set the angle to 360 so it can rotate back to the same position. And make it more from the previous one. If we click preview, the element should rotate. Last thing is transforming one element to another one. Say you want to transform this angry man to a happy one. Simply make the happy one more from the angry one and click preview you will find the angry man is transforming to the happy one now that we have covered the morph effect starting with moving the element around making an element expand outward and then disappear rotating element and last transforming one element to another one i have uploaded this file in the external resources so you can download it and check out every move we have done in the morph effect next we will discuss another nice effect called the move in let's check it out <laughs> 